Delivery driver or returning delivery drivers on DoorDash and Uber Eats, listen up. You need to hear this. This is me one more time. Nine thing at a time podcast. Activate negativity. I don't know why I'm keep coming to this channel. DoorDash and Uber Eats. Goodbye forever. I spoke to somebody recently saying something about... So I spoke to somebody. I'm like, yo, what's the status with uh, DoorDash and Uber Eats? And he was telling me that there's literally no... Back in the days, used to make like maybe 100 or 120, something like that. Now, after the border crisis and everything, everybody's here near the New York side, it is completely dead okay i mean it is completely dead there's nobody's there there's no rides and if you even turn it on by schedule i think they have what i don't know if the schedule system was there or not but if you turn it on if you even watch tv there's literally sing zero calls that yo you have to go there this is an absolute horrible news this is a very tragic story that now doordash and uber eats has been cut in half so if this is just happening to doordash and all this other food delivery service then seamless grubhub then think about what about the rest might be going through i also made a video that if all the migrants become ceo or entrepreneur then what gonna happen that video is actually on my page you want to take a look a lot of us know if you're following my channels knew this is gonna happen this crisis is gonna happen what if all of them start joining the teachers what if all of them start selling houses you know one day you know Every, everything's gonna be affected but anyway in this topic the DoorDash topics and the uber eats and the, the delivery driving topics what really hurts me the most is what about the retirees what about the retirees who do DoorDash people who are you know have a leg problems I saw some old men doing some deliveries and they're like with their sticks doing deliveries and driving car very slowly and then the other drivers are respectfully let him go let him go to pick up the delivery to do the Starbucks coffee delivery you know they're not gonna get any delivery that is that's hurts me most because there's a lot of veterans out there who coming back and they're like you know what now i already have the retired money i have everything i'm gonna do this you know they're gonna have zero calls this is bad so only one way to save the previous existing worker job on this delivery service is by literally programming the algorithm that listen if you're being a door dasher or if you're being a doing this xyz delivery driving for this many years then we're gonna let you you will be the priority because now you have to kind of do a little bit of age related there hey if somebody's a military veteran somebody's going through some accessibility situation i think i want to give them some service because if you deny the service if you if you don't give the handicapped man or somebody who's been doing the beginning when the delivery service started and that person had a five star and a top 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 star review if that person does not get a ride on on this platform that kind of make the company look bad okay so so only number one advice if you're already struggling with this delivery apps or delivery jobs this is the number one advice i have to give you on my activate motive from my activate motivation channel where i should be uploading this thing is this number one thing you have worked hard enough or you have worked on this delivery driving short period of time or longer period of time right now it's time for you right now listen to this this is what you have to do now right now it's time for you this is uncomfortable truth but listen to this right now your time has has come to change the elevator the money elevator you need to change the elevator so what do you have done you know this happened on business as entrepreneurship thinking like you know what is a good thing or bad thing because when before amazon came up amazon had other business what i heard and th those business crashed then amazon become big but the the lesson the ceo learned jeff bezos learned he learned it from those bad businesses and then Amazon blew up. So right now is your time to change the elevator for money. You cannot be just doing the same thing over and over. Right now the border is open. Everybody's going to do the same thing. Just like photography. Photography, everybody might be start doing photography. Everybody's going to try to sell uh, bananas for certain price, right? Everybody's going to give out $1 coffee. If you've been already hurted by that business or that product, I need you to change the elevator, escalator to a different escalator. But the, this one's going to be a big next level jump. But for the freshmen or the new people to ruin your next level job, they have to be mentally prepared and they have to be technically prepared to ruin your job and ruining a technical job is hard and it's gonna take some time for the migrant crisis to become ceo
that I have a video I made earlier. So you have to do something more technical or you, you need to become a little bit next level of instant money. You have to do instant money in a next harder level on a different, it could be anything, you know, something, maybe you want to sell something else this time. Maybe you want to open a retail shop, but no, not really because retail is also dangerous nowadays. But you want to do something different. If you don't have a saving, that might not be a, too much of a luck, but you want to different, do something different. And then if they're going to come up and ruin your business in future, then at that time, you're going to have a good amount of money. You're going to level up on a different level different industry okay this is me one more time i approve this message you want to definitely press hard and you want to save this video and you want to check out my other videos i also have other channels if you want to take a look my following to check on my page who i follow okay you want to always level up now this is very scary and this is uh this is scary if you, especially if you have a families and stuff right you can if you raise your price there's no point because somebody else is going to try to cut down the price even think about the girls if a girls are doing only fans and they're selling something for ten dollar or five dollar monthly subscription some other border crisis girl can sell stuff for one dollar she could be selling for one dollar and if she sell if, if a woman sell her body for one dollar or 50 cents all it gonna affect all the only fans girl over and out that's why you need to vote for me you know because i'm the only one who can change this thing you know you have to i'm telling you this is the only one way to fix this thing is you have to vote for me i'm telling you so for that i need your like and subscribe my friend vote for me like and subscribe i'll see you in the next one peace out over